my expectation is ultimately um, for students to decide for themselves after all of the readings and all of the discussion, are they going to be um, describing themselves as Madisonian, in which there is a narrow interpretation of the Constitution and declare war rests with Congress as it's explicitly an Article I power? Or are they going to find themselves to be more Hamiltonian, having a broader interpretation of the Constitution? You can't practice international relations or foreign policy if you don't understand the basic tenets of uh, the Constitution when it comes specifically to war powers. So I think this could benefit a variety of students, not just a certain subset.